if you have ever used a copy machine to make a, an image larger or smaller you already are familiar with the concept of scaling objects now the same way as we uh, scale our images larger or smaller using a copying machine we're going to scale our objects larger or smaller using the scale command in AutoCAD now here I've got some objects on my screen I'm going to scale these objects by going to, to home tab and uh, selecting the scale command on the modify panel I'm going to launch that I'm going to scale this uh, chair to half of its original size for that I'm going to select that I'm going to right click and pick a base point now the base point is the only point of that object that it's not going to change now we're going to get that rubber band effect right here but I'm going to enter uh, a number here now in AutoCAD the scaling uh, numbers uh, one represents uh, the one by one or the original scale and if you want to scale this down to half of its original size we have to enter 0.5 and press enter now let's see another one I'm going to scale this object this other chair to make it double bigger I'm going to select it and right click and pick a base point scale it two times and for that I'm going to enter two and enter now we can use the scale uh, command in AutoCAD to deal with the unit difference problem in, a, in a documents and for that I'm going to show you an example I'm going to clo uh, close this I'm going to save that I'm going to press open and we'll go to the chapter 9 folder and from the lesson 8 we're going to select the court and racket by holding down uh, holding down the shift key on our keyboard and open those two now we want to see these two documents side by side by going to the view tab and the windows panels I'm going to uh, press this tile vertically there we go now I'm going to put the focus on this chord first and uh, this drawing represents a standard tennis court and the units here are in feed we can verify that by going to the application menu drawing utilities and units and there you see it's in feet I'm going to cancel out of this and the other one the right one uh, represents a tennis racket and the units here are in inches we can verify that quickly as well as you see it's in inches we're going to cancel out of this and in this tennis court we need another racket and we, uh, we want to copy this racket into the court by selecting it and select and drag it right here and we're going to release it here now we see the problem here this racket is huge as you see here the units represent uh, the inches and this racket is supposed to be 26 inches well the AutoCAD sees the units not the numbers in this case uh, and when we copy this to the other document the 
it's still the 26 but in this case it's 26 feet which is 12 times bigger than the size it's need to be now to solve this uh, we can use the scale command and I'm going to minimize this for now and maximize this one here I'm going to zoom a little select the scale command from my home tab and modify panel select in this right click give it a base point which and we are going to scale it to 1 here and enter now let's see if that worked we're going to move this from here any point is going to be okay to here as we see uh, we scaled this uh, racket very quickly and now the scale is uh, what it's originally intended to be whether we need to scale the objects as a uh, part of a design change or we want to correct the unit differences uh, we can scale our objects uh, larger or smaller with the scale command in AutoCAD.